that has gone out of date. We are mobilizing our language scholars and we are mobilizing our young men who are interested. And very soon you will see a big program of Yoruba and language revival going on all over Yoruba. Uh, we hold meetings and we, talk, we speak English. Uh, that's not of real importance in a place like this, on a television like this, where there are young people who are scattered all over the world who may not understand it. And so it's okay we speak to them in English, but we tell them, Yoruba language is your language, and you must find some way to learn it. Ask your parents to teach it to you in their homes in Australia, in uh, Papua New Guinea, in uh, South Africa. Wherever in China, wherever you live, you children yourself demand to know your language. But that's your language. Very soon, you may have your own country where the only language that will be the official language will be the Yoruba language. If you don't speak that language, then you are discounting yourself. So let us all take it seriously. We are going to revive Yoruba language. People who are saying Yoruba language could echo. We should be saying that it is impossible. Okay, um, we have with all one of the organizers of today that has not been really noticed very much. She's a regular law. She's joining us from New York, in the United States. So, can you the floor for her to say a few words? And we move into questions and answers. Where is Dr. Kinga? I saw you, I didn't see him. That's why I was asking about We're trying to find you. Where is Dr. Kinga? Yeah. I'm trying to get him. Maybe he's having a problem with his telephone or something. Yes. As we wait for him, let's have um, a real let me call the talking about myself. Very little bit of Perfect. Yes, hey, why I'm put her. I'm calling the talking about myself. You have to unmute yourself. Unmute yourself. Wait for others. Let's start uh, 
entertain questions. So we type questions on the Q and A session, okay. and I will pick it up. Can I answer them here? Yes, please. So please type in your questions. So we'll pick them up very quickly. Somebody asking if that is the custody of daily time. Yes, it is that dollar daily. It is that for control of daily. It's one of the leaders. We have your. Ola says your surrounding is dark. But I'm sure oh. he can see us. Let's leave the standard. What about uh, what about Taju? The the, the uh, that is going to be. He's going to be a state. He's going to come up soon. Hey, I'm surprised. He's coming up soon. The message of today. Him and Poloni. Are you coming up? There's a question to you, sir. Uh, what are our immediate goals? How, how can we achieve them? What That's are the leader. What's the question? What are our immediate goals and how can the diaspora rally together for execution? Yeah. Our immediate goal is to, uh, to really create strength for the Yoruba World Congress. We need to have the strength to do a lot of things that we want to do. And that means that we must mobilize our people to support the Yoruba World Congress. And we need that. We need that. And uh, we also want our people to support some specific projects, like the language project. Our people our intellectuals in the area of language are putting together the program now. And uh, I have told them, just put together a viable program. Don't worry about the resources. You will find the money. So when we come to you and we say our language program is going to also show and progress all of that, that is in charge of it, we want all our people to arise and help that program. Secondly, if we come to you and we say we are starting our Saturday school program, and this is how much it will come for us to, to run it. We want our people to rise up and help us. In short, the Yoruba World Congress is not going to be asking for just money for money, give us money. No, we will be cooking before you specific, specific program and be asking you to help us get it done. Uh, some of you from the United States have come to us in the past week to suggest that we should organize a referendum of Yoruba people and ask the question, you want your own country, yes or no? Uh, yes, we are putting together a committee now from all the diaspora and all uh, to, yeah, to work that out, then we will know how it's going to be done and how much it's going to cost. And then we will then be asking our people to find the money. We Yoruba World Congress are operating on the very uh, definite assurance, on the confidence that there is nothing that we are attempt to do that we will not be able to do because of money. It's not going to happen. Uh, already we are seeing signs of we, uh, we When we started, uh, our young people said, let's have a secretariat. Organizations in your land don't have a secretary unless have a secretary. Uh, uh, then it happened. One of our men, one of our most uh, substantial men, traveled to America. Uh, he came back, he called me, said, Professor, can we see you? Uh, I said, okay, uh, uh, you want to come and see me? No, 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 you are, you, know, you are younger than I am, you are a bigger man. Let me come and see you. So I went to see him, and he said, I was in America, everybody is talking about you, everybody is talking about you, uh, and, and it would be good for you to have a secretariat. 
Uh, so you can reach the people abroad. Uh, I, I said, yes, sir. Uh, but, but, you know, this thing is my like that. Okay. Go and tell your people to put their idea together. How much money do they need to put it together? I will give all the money. And he gave us the money. And we created a Supra Mountain Secretariat in Lagos. We call it International Secretariat. Then our people in Badash, Badash, center of our political life in Yoruba land. Then our people in Badash began to raise the question, ah, we are putting the Secretariat in Lagos, what about in Badash? So I said, all right. They decided to make a joke about us. They said, we, we who are in Lagos, we are the Lagos Mafia. <laughs> so I said, all right, we will help you create a Badash Mafia. <laughs> so we need that money to create a Secretariat in Badash. And lo and behold, the money came. Somebody calls me and said, I'm coming. I want to come and see you, sir. What do you want to do? Uh, I can help now. If I go back again abroad. I uh, said, uh, we have this problem with our wife, but the people, they want a secretariat. We, are, we need a secretariat there. I said, okay, sir. How much do you think it will cost? I think, and I said, I think uh, 5 million, 4 million. And he said, okay, I will come back tomorrow morning. I came back tomorrow morning, I gave me the money. And I called the people in my head. I have the money in my hand. I called the secretary. And uh, the, the boys and girls in the matter, I told them, listen, I have the money in my hand. Do go and find a good place for the secretary. And the people that God just creating a secretary that is infinitely more beautiful than the international secretary of the So I have come to uh, the, I think that is God at work. I have come to the very clear perception of the Uruguay World Congress as an agency that God has sent to lift the Uruguay people up. There is nothing we want to do that we will not find the resources to do. I believe that now. Thank you very much, sir. So Thank wait for much. us. Wait for us. We will hear about the language program soon. Wait for us. We will hear about the referendum soon. Do we yes. have international allies? Please, if you don't get sharing. We have not been able to get uh, Dr. Kimber. You have not got uh, a renew from the U.S. Yeah, I would say, what, what about uh, the... Uh, it will lose here, but we can't hear. It will lose here, but we cannot hear. We can't hear, sir. That's what about, what about Princess Moradin? Mar 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 yeah. Princess, ah. Princess. The yes. Let me source that. Okay, I'll source that. Let me, let me source that. Shola? Can you that? What about Shola? And also Taj, you did. Yeah, I've been trying to get Taj. He's not answering his phone. So I'm going to try again. But I'll speak to Princess Moderna. Oh, uh, okay. I've sent her a message as well. Okay, send here. Off, send here. Uh, let, um, okay, can we get, can we get, I'll try and put, um, can you, can you talk to us? Can you, can you tell me about what's Hello? She's live, nice, but I can't hear her. I'm too sorry about this. Okay. Okay, let me let me try and find yeah, Shola. Okay. I'll give you a Shola. You want to come? I'll get Shola. What's the question? From your end or from my end? I mean, no, no, we can hear yeah, you, sir. sir. We're talking about Erelu, Titilayo, Alau. We can't, we can't get them. But everybody is on not. No one is muted. Um, what's the question? Well, let's see how we can hear. Yeah. What's the question? I'm going to try and bring Shola. Shola, what's her name again? Shola Salako. That's it. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. I can't see her here. You can't see her there. No. I've typed her name, but I can't see it. Shola Salako. No. Eshe, we don't sir. Eh, kun, joko, no, eh. Right, guys. Here's the questions about communication. You say, what are we doing? Make sure that our information is moved across Nigeria and beyond. Do you, sir, do you want to go for that one? I'll ask, ask, uh, 
how you can talk on that. Yes, okay. All right. Sir, I'll put you there forward. Thank you. Uh, sir, what would you like to say on that, sir? Well, uh, majorly, our leader has been making broadcasts, he's been, he's been, uh, he's been talking to the, to the public, he's been talking to Nigerians. And what we want to start doing now is uh, organize a lot of interviews, get prominent Yoruba leaders in the country to talk about the way forward. Uh, interviews from Yoruba leaders in commerce, Yoruba leaders in economy, Yoruba leaders in uh, intelligentsia, Yoruba leaders in uh, labor, and so on and so forth. Yoruba leaders who are ex military men, and so on as Yoruba leaders who are former heads of service or permanent secretary and so on, and also get younger people among the Yoruba people also to plant interviews. Younger people, people in their age, 20s and 30s, to start speaking up on what they want and what they want from Yoruba leadership and what they want for Yoruba as a country on our own. Uh, that is going to uh, uh, be, 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 be alive very, very soon. Interviews, interviews and so on. And um, that is it. And when we when we do, like we, we have uh, town hall meetings, we'll be having, we'll be having meetings, as soon as COVID is over, we'll be having meetings in the battle, we'll be having meetings all over the place, and in, even from in state capitals, coordinators will also be organizing meetings, and such meetings will be televised, will be properly uh, uh, properly communicated to, to, to all and sundry. So in essence, we're going to ensure that we carry everybody along. But at the same time, we don't want to be frivolous. We just want to talk for talking sake. I don't want to be seen as people who just make noise. There's a question for you, sir. It says, what are we doing with the CAP CC? What are the involvements of Yoruba CAP CC? Is it from somebody? Can you put your location when you type in your question. So you can have name and location as well when your question for me. Our involvement with the CAP CC, sir. I'm sure the leaders uh, are very much yeah. involved. The cabins yeah. are very much uh, going to meet them. Happy, as happy day, day, yes, happy day. Happy day, the cabins is up with us. Uh, we were not so sure at the beginning that we could get them the way we are getting them now. now. I do not I do not know of any organization in recent times that our faculty are supporting as much as they are supporting the Yoruba World Congress now. Yes, yes. Uh, maybe, maybe in the time of Ifaula or yes, but since then never. Uh, we are Yoruba World Congress is uh, I let me tell you, yesterday two of us phoned me. So ask me that to ask me about today's meeting. That's the meeting we are holding now. <laughs> yeah. They wanted to find out whether they could join. These are very, yes, these are very high of us. And I said, ah, you see, uh, I, I don't know that uh, we, are, uh, we can accommodate the man of your station in our. <laughs> no, can you see? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm greeting you. Of, uh, uh, I, 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 all over Yoruba land. People had never met before. And they want to tell me, ah, Baba, I took my attention. Ah, Baba, I was like, Chef, I can't do it. I have been one by the family in the country. So I am now planning a major tour of Yoruba land just to visit our offers and let them know we appreciate them. That's all. We have the offers. There is no question about that. JMC from Canada wants to know when we can start flying the rubber flag. Yes, 
yes, we are looking at that. We are planning. It is something we are, we are uh, and I told you to do. And, uh, but we need to manage very carefully. We are Yoruba. I, when I say we are Yoruba, I mean we, you know, we have the intellectual way. We are with all. Civilization, sophistication uh, to do things right. Nobody is not a summer to bother us. We will do it very soon. Abe uh, from South Africa is asking how do we handle our politicians towards the creation of a Yoruba Republic, a Yoruba nation? Are they going uh, to sabotage it? For their selfish interest. Well, when God has stretched forth his mighty hand, nobody can bend it back. Uh, that's what I say about the coming of Yoruba nation state. God has stretched forth his mighty hand for the Yoruba nation. And nobody can bend it back. I know that there are politicians among us who love Yoruba. I know there are politicians among us who love the Yoruba nation but love their own ambitions more than the Yoruba nation. Uh, all of that, when we put it together, I see this is God in action and nobody can stop that. That is it, sir. Yes. Well, thank you very much. I think I'm. Papa Kimba is trying to log on. They tell me. Is there any development of AY? Look for them. I'll pick him up. I'll pick him up. Dr. Kimba is trying to log on. Let's do that now. Okay. Yes, try to see if you can get it. Yeah, try to do that. Now, there are some people who have us work on this thing. I don't know why we can't get you. Who's one of our UK people online? Yeah, we I'm, can't. Um, we, need to, we need to get chat to. I'm trying. They're trying to get him on there. Um, representative from Canada, from the USA. We recognize you. We recognize you. Um, from France. Well, I got from France. We know you are there. From California, yes, we see you. Thank you very much. Now here's a question. Can you um, but you didn't put your location though, have you so just take your location so I can read you. From London, where is it? Please let it sing to everyone that know the structure to the dual nation. Actually from London, yes. We read you. Um Olamik Goke from Brazil says I would like to know the meaning of our two flags. Our and two flag. flag. Stars oh, on the period of the flag. From Brazil, they want to know the meaning of the stars. Is there a flag that we put stars on? Yeah, there are some. Let me answer that. There is no. The flag is this, ladies and gentlemen. No, we have, not created, no. we have no, not created the Yoruba flag. Yes, so there, are many, there are many organizations that uh, have put up uh, groups that have created a uh, flag. Yes, there are some of our young people who created a flag about three years ago, very few, yes. but we have not had one yet. Thank you very much. There is no official flag. But for the purposes of educating the people in question, those who have signed those flags, and there are many of them, it should be our right to ask them. Generally, the stars are there to by the first Yoruba kingdom. But, I mean, we can do it to understand it. But there is official flag. That is their answer. Well, it, it, it's it's work in progress. Um, from Adele Rishiko from Luxembourg is asking, when are we going to request a referendum? We are set. We have set up a committee on. Uh, it is the committee from now on that tell us, that give us the uh, 
Then he added, if it is about, if it is discovered that the law of the country is being violated, that somebody has gone beyond his fundamental right, the law is very clear on this. What government is concerned about is that violence was part of canon agitation for the uh, to realize his dream of the Afghan. I think that I think that is what the government is trying to tackle. So, so listen. So, if Kano is talking about Biafra, he's free to talk about Biafra, and everybody is free to talk about his understanding of the Nigerian state. We are always talking that the Nigerian state is not working, and we are always asking, how can we make it work? If the best option is to call for separate countries, why not? That's, a, that's a, uh, uh, angle of the line. If they, uh, we, Yoruba, have decided that the best solution is to come for our own. Or perhaps even the dissolution of Nigeria, so we can settle it after all. That is it. Uh, but we, uh, so there is no need for any violence. The road for discussion is already clear. So we just walk that road in a sophisticated manner. We, yeah, we must walk. Uh, we need the Yoruba World Congress. We'll operate with, uh, with uh, methods of peaceful organization, peaceful demands, peaceful negotiation, peaceful propaganda, and peaceful political persuasion. We will push for negotiating tables, we will never put a push for street brawls or any kind of conflict. That's it. That's the Yoruba agenda as far as that is concerned. And thank you. I, I, I might conclude that by saying to our Yoruba people, the Yoruba cause is a just and noble cause. We ask our Yoruba people to have the courage to support these peaceful process. This is a time to forgive what offenses that might linger from the past. It's a time for Yoruba people to dare to take hold of courage and hope. From all that we are seeing, it is obvious that the Almighty God, the creator and ruler of all nations, has great and pleasant changes in all our Yoruba nation now. And we have a good reason. We know the world. We have good reason to hope. That a just world will support and assist our noble cause. That, that's the message about our, our nation. We are ready for our nation. We will rise. We are not going to settle the matter of the Yoruba nation on the battlefield or on city brawls, city street or brawls. No. We will rise from a negotiating table one day and say, Praise the Lord, we have our country. That's the way it is. Uh, 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 I think, uh, Professor Kelly, I think our leader should uh, assure all people listening in this assembly that while we are going to negotiate to leave, to, to, to take our uh, self determination, they will not submit the Yoruba nation to people coming to kill, maim, and uh, rape our women, why we just stand that I mean, the, 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 one of the things that our leader has always told us is that we must defend ourselves at all times to find his first out in battle. He assured all the groups, about 100 associations that came to welcome him, that the Yoruba will not be slaughtered like a lamb that tied to the post, that the Yoruba will also have a right to defend themselves on their own land. I think it's important to assure our people that the yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Chief. That's where we stand. Uh, it was our pressurized movement that created a significant change in the attitude of our ruler. Of our they have And we are solidly behind them. And it is going on. Because this coronavirus uh, disruption that has stopped, they are already beginning to go. Uh, but even without our network, 
we in Yoruba Congress, we already have our own machinery. We don't talk about it. So we have our own machinery. The Yoruba people, uh, you would have noticed that more, less and less of violence is coming to Yoruba land. What they are now doing is trying to, uh, is a uh, uh, young government problem is that the uh, Almagiri people who have been taken to their places of origin don't want to be taken. They want their freedom. Uh, so many of them are running southward. But our governors are doing us a good favor that they have mounted the patrols in the borders of our six states. And as they come, they are picked up and sent back. Must say thank you to our governor for that. For that. And we, the Yoruba Watch Congress, are in very close contact with our governor. Now we are at the beginning, we didn't know what was happening. Our people didn't know what was happening. Uh, we thought it was just uh, tattoo men drinking tattoo because they are drought in the north. But we did later knew that it is a plan, it is a planned invasion using the tattoo men. And are coming to this year. And uh, we have a reason for it. Our people, too, on the, their own, have a reason for it in their own. Uh, the traditional methods of self defense, of community defense, have been revved up. And already they have uh, created fear in the hearts of many of them. They themselves have been running back because uh, the, uh, the thunder and lightning. Uh, 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 the other types of uh, of, uh, of assault and threats are already going to uh, are already uh, uh, operating in our land, and so I'm attacking is just going to be the icing on the cake. But we will defend our land. But it's going to be so. So no Yoruba president from now on. We have made up our mind. I'm just. We have seen one or two places where it has occurred. Some places near Ibada, some places in another part of Akoko, you know, those states, uh, and so on. Uh, I won't say any more about that. Our people are up and ready and vigilant. And our government at last have got vigilant and at least some of the great people. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much, mother, our fathers and mother. Thank you very much. Um, we can stay here forever, then to come to an end. And with that, we run. I, 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 would, like, I, I, I would like to hear the young man that you The young man who, who I have myself given the assignment of. Of hey, you get yeah. Hey, yeah, we need to. We need to. Yeah. Hey, why? He's trying to lift him up. I don't know. We want to get out tonight. Maybe it's the next one. I don't know what's going on. What of Dr. Akinga, for God's sake? And Dr. Akinga, too. I'm trying to log in, too. I think it's next one. What any Nigerian that can do a network, who can be the next provider of good internet service, a Yoruba internet service would be great. Our people are communicating. Okay, this is, uh, yeah, this is a, yeah, this is a challenge. We yes. must we must respond to it. It's a challenge. We need we need a reliable a reliable means of uh, mobilizing our people. Yes, um, yeah. There's a yeah. question we've answered this question, but again, the people of Para will be I think Baba, you might want to talk about it again. They are fully on our map. Para could be a doe and delta. I'm been a republic. I'm been a I, have republic. I have attended many meetings of the Yoruba World Congress. Yes. You're fully on our mouth. I've got TJ now. I've got TJ now, I think. Let me see. I believe I've oh, got TJ. Found him. Yeah, okay. Found him. Found him. Yeah. On mute. More. On mute. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay. So TJ Rahim is on with us. I'm just trying to get in. I'm just uh, chasing. Hi, TJ. Can you talk to us? Uh, can you? Uh, we need to hear from you. Uh, can you? We need to see you as well, please. Thank you don't you mind. Uh, 
I just walk with you. Okay, hold on. Okay, one second. It's gonna try. It's, it's coming on board. One second. Shoot. Uh, yeah. Let me see what I can bring uh, on. Planning to start. What? My computer. A Y from UK. A Relu from US. Paul O'Neill from Nigeria. Are we on Cuba? Hey, JJ, come on, get with us. He's here. He's here. He's, he's, he's here, sir. He's just, he's just getting ready. Yes. Just give me a few minutes. Uh, Professor Killer, could you just um, tell us a bit more about... Uh, somebody was asking a question about Amoteco and uh, the role of uh, the interaction between Amoteco and um, uh, uh, your Bible Congress. I wonder if you could give us some info on that. Uh, you mean, uh, well, okay. we were at the rewinding from the beginning because we were worried uh, about what was happening. We were worried about what was happening to our all over our region. Uh, yeah. uh, so the governor built it to the voice of all the affairs that it meant. And finally, we launched Amateur. Okay. We were there at the launch of Amateur. Okay. And we are with Amateur. Everything should be there. We are in regular contact with people who are managing the Amateur. No, it is coming. It is coming. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Um, uh, I think, let me, let me see. Um, there's a question coming from the live stream. Um, Professor Killer, are we okay to look at them? Professor Killer, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Let me see. I'll just pick up one or two questions from the live stream and see if we can answer them via the uh, live stream. Hang on, let me see. Is uh, Sergio around? Sergio, are you ready? Oh, yeah. Sergio Dean is ready. We'll come back to the questions later. Uh, Sergio Dean, welcome on board. How are you doing? I'm very fine, sir. Thank okay. you for having me here. You're very welcome. We've been trying to, you're a hard man to catch. We've been trying to catch you, get, get, grab a hold of you. We've been trying to, you know, locate you. Uh, you seem, you just went off, off the radar, but that you have you. No, here. I've never been hard to get anything concerning Yoruba and Yoruba World Congress. Yes. I'm always there, 24-7. So, you know where to get anytime. Okay. Uh, uh, let's go. Let's go. I'll help you now. Sorry, I'm going to pin. Video and I will beg your pardon. I'm just going to bring him on and I'm going to pin him here. Um, uh, Professor Killer, would you like to uh, uh, step in here uh, with questions? Yes, okay, yes. Um, let's have a question. For me as well, I'm trying to come in, but the network is not helping us. I don't know why. I want to get Paul Loni in. Paul um, Okay, I'll do that. I'll look at We They were together with you in planning all the things, so we get to get from them. We're still hoping to hear from uh, Oh, sorry, I got Paul Oni as well. Oh, we're in business. I got him, is it now? Uh, okay. Promoter panelist is in as well. Let me see. Can I get him? Yeah. Oh, let's see. Let me see. What about Princess um, Morale? I'm going to, I'm going to look. Yes, thank you, sir. I'm going to look at her. I will look at her. You if you're online, uh, you can. Please, once you share your name, if you're online, then phone down. We can, we can hear you. So, if you're online, Oh, you are. So there's um, this question. Um, Ayola in Toronto, you have a link with Cuba. And the short answer is yes, but I think Baba should give the longer answer. Do we have a link yeah, with we, Cuba? We, What's we, we, we have, uh, in our planning, we divide the uh, Yoruba diaspora into two. There is the older Yoruba diaspora. As the younger Yoruba diaspora, the, the older Yoruba diaspora is the diaspora that comes from the late same era, the 16th and 17th century. And there are the people in Brazil, Cuba, Suriname, all the countries of Central America and the West. 
So we classify them as the old diaspora and we are very, very close to them. In fact, some of them came on their own a few weeks ago. I held a meeting in the international headquarters in Cuba. And that included people from Cuba, from Brazil, from Mexico, from uh, somebody came from Spain. And yeah, so we are in contact with them. We are in contact with uh, our older diaspora. And I might say also uh, that uh, we are in contact with the leadership of I am uh, um, um, in contact uh, with one of their greatest leaders, the son of the great uh, Arabian uh, leader. Uh, what are you reminding me, uh, Secretary? The great, greatest leader here, political leader here. Okay. Uh, I have a contact with his son, Julius. Uh, he's a doctor. So we are. Uh, I was talking about. Um, Dr. Dr. Oh, sorry. Go ahead, go ahead, sorry. Go ahead, Dr. That's it. Yes, I'm talking about his son. That's Dr. Yes, that's correct. Yeah, yeah, we are, we are, but we are in contact with our, the older diaspora. The, the younger diaspora, of course, is easier to contact, uh, but we must contact for because each has its own particular kind of contribution to make. Um, I, I, so I'd like to bring in um, Sadi Jim, because uh, you've been asking for Insta, so I'd like to bring okay, him forward. <laughs> Uh -huh, okay. So can we do that? So, so uh, questions for Tajidu? Can we or uh, what? Um, how do we go? No, about that? Let him talk. Don't let him talk. We just want. We just want his voice. Okay. Just want to talk. So give us uh, some idea. Uh, all all there you go. The all yours. Very much, sir. Uh, first of all, I want to thank our amiable leader. Uh, Professor Banji Atitui, um, please. And I want to thank every um, Yoruba World Congress elder that has been working tirelessly to make sure that this program uh, is here today. And of course, our General Secretary, uh, Professor Kila, thank you so much. I've been having a wonderful conversation with him, and it's been very, very good. Great. Uh, Mr. A.Y., yes, sir. well done. Very good job. You know, he's part of our Yoruba World Congress in the UK here. Yes. Um, I want to thank Baba once again for making him the Yoruba World Congress Secretary here in the UK and Europe. I want to thank everyone here that we are working tirelessly, but we cannot do it, do it without uh, some certain uh, personality. First of all, I want to thank our uh, chief, uh, Shola Fawaini. That's the younger brother of Ghani Fawaini. He has been working behind the scene. And Baba, you know about that many times. He's been calling and been working. So many things going on. Um, chief Odedu as well, on behalf of Chief Odedu. Uh, many more like that. Chief Palashe. Chief Alashe is the um, Yoruba Forum. And I want to tell each and every one of us here that the Yoruba Elders Forum in the UK, they are 100% behind Yoruba World Congress. So that is a very good, you know, news. Um, with us here in the UK, of course, our naval leader, Sholan Salapo, on behalf of her, I want to thank everyone. Um, Pastor OK. He's our, you know, man behind the scene. He's doing all the work for us. Um, I want to also thank our Baba, Baba Belo, Frank Belo, a outspoken person, even before any one of us came into this struggle. Baba Belo and Baba Ajala, they've been working hard to bring many of us to this realization. I want to thank them all. Um, 
I want to thank so many attenders that are in the UK here who are working hand in hand with us here. Number one, take it to Parapo, Edba, Ikesha, Yoruba Tennis Club. I want us to know that, that they are really, really behind us. So we need to actually, from Yoruba War Conference uh, in, the, uh, in Nigeria, we need to recognize them. So, um, and next time, when we're going to be having this meeting, um, Chief Palashe will be very, very happy to join us here. Um, but I cannot, we cannot, you know, complete this without mentioning our very, very important media outlet in the UK that have been bringing Yoruba World Congress, not only in the UK, but all over the world, um, heritage. I want to thank him so much because the first time when we will have Uh, it's frozen. Just bear with me. It's frozen. Hopefully, you'll come back. Uh, I will let uh, Professor Pilar call step in. No, I don't. No, come back. Yeah, let's uh, uh, Yeah, and we. While, while, okay, while, 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 while we are waiting for <laughs> so, uh, this young man has been on the phone. Okay, he's back. Uh, can you hear me now? Hello? Yeah, we can hear you. We can hear you. We can hear okay. you. Okay. Okay. So, um, AY Citizen, thank you so much for your hard work and um, everything you put together to make this um, meeting come to pass. Thank you so much. And I also want to thank our mommy. I spoke to her yesterday uh, in America. A relief, a ship going on you. I think we should continue our conversation. Uh, Baba uh, Akogun. I met you in Nigeria last year with Baba. Uh, if you remember me, you know, when I came to Baba and then you guys blessed me and then you said, go and make sure that you put your Baba Congress, you know, together in the UK. So, so far, so good. We've been doing the work and I promise you there's still more work to do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sir.
trying to do something. We'd like to, we look, I'm, I'm also trying to get to, to, to bring on board Princess Boda and Moladeo. So just give me a minute. And Professor Killer, can you just anchor whilst I try and sort that out, please? Professor Killer. Do what you have to say back to the there now. Not yet. Yes. Not yet. Yes. He's trying to find it. He's trying to find it. He'll get it. He will come on top of it. Um, what is it? Um, what is it? Um, what is it? Um, what is it? People asking for specific things. Now, a good way to go ahead is to go to our website and send in your email questions, comments, and suggestions. And have, have, have. we have a whole lot of working on issues. It's a very big task we have a time. There is space for your people. So if you get in touch with your specific area of interest or concern, we shall be happy to have you on board. And come with you. Um, expansion of tax and branches. Yeah, so it's frozen. Okay, I'll step in. Anybody want to? There is a question here. One second, please. Ah, sir, that was, was it as was um, we will we, we for it. Um, uh, Professor Killer to come back. Let me just ask a question. I'll pose the question to um, our esteemed leader, uh, Professor um, uh, Professor uh, Akito, uh, Akito, Sir, um, a, a, a caller asked a question. They asked a question. Uh, can you hear me, sir? Can you hear me? Can you hear me, sir? Yes, I'm hearing you. Okay. A uh, caller yes. asked a question. He said, uh, I don't know, well, it's a bit of a double echo. They say, do. Actually, no, I can't ask you that part for the question. So let me ask the second part of it. The second part of the question is about the governor. Um, what steps can really get in behind yourself? Um, what steps can be can we do take to make sure that the governors of all the southern southwestern states get behind you as our leader? Um, and, and, and do, are there steps to place for that kind of thing to happen? That was the question that was put to me. The first half of the question. You can't answer it because it's somebody else. Go ahead. Uh, uh, yeah, that's something we need to do. But it's not really getting behind us or coming along with us. Yes. Yes. The fight for our, the fight for our nation. And they are holding certain elements of power that none of us hold. Only the six of them hold that. Element of power, executive power over the life of our people. But I think right to our direct time to us that this Human World Congress is not just another organization, it's an organization that is fully organization out of the mess that we made now. And we are very serious, we are very dedicated. Careful. They will work with us. I am fine. But now they are, they are young men. They are still crazy big men. They are governor. And your excellency, I'm sure, <laughs> by and by, they will know that in the interest of our people, we have to work with them. I believe that that is so calm. I believe it's already the beginning to come up. They're already hearing echoes of it. No, yeah, go ahead. Okay, I'll bring you up. I think there is a uh, there is a mantra that we need to keep reminding ourselves. Actually, <laughs> when we see the new dawn, this is a new organization. Let us from today embrace the idea that we are all builders of this new Yoruba nation. This new dawn. It is not a place where somebody stays behind and points finger and asks questions. Bring your suggestion. Nobody is in charge of everything for everything. We are all builders. A little bit of free, a little bit of science, and that is how we are going to this great new world. So please, we have the technology on our side. 
because it has been the fact. And that's what I'm saying about the coming of Yoga Nation. God has stretched forth his mighty hand for the Yoga Nation. And no body can bend the fact. I know that there are politicians among us who love Yoga Nation. I know there are politicians among us. Who love the Yoruba nation but love their own ambitions, all that. Uh, all of that, when we put it together, I believe this is God in action, and nobody can stop coming. That is it, sir. Yes. Well, thank you very much. I think I'm. Dr. Well, Kimba. He's trying to log on, they tell me. Is there any development of that? Why? I'll pick him up. Dr. Kiba is trying to log on. Let's do it now. Okay. Yes, try what? to see if you can get it. Yeah, try to do that. Now, there are some people who have us work on this thing. I don't know why we can't get you, who's all of our UK people online. Yeah. We I'm, can't um on we, need to, we need to get chat to I've been trying. They're trying to get him on there. Um, representative from Canada, from the USA. We recognize you. We recognize you. Um, from France. Well, I got from France. We know you are there. From California, yes, we see you. Thank you very much. Now, here's the question. Can you remember? Um, but you didn't put your location, though. Have you done? So, just again with your location so I can read you. From London, where is it? Please let it say to everyone that no. Instruction to the dual nation. Actually, from London, yes. We read you. Um, Olami Koke from Brazil says, I would like to know the meaning of our two flags. Our the two stars flag. The stars of the Syrian Yoruba flag. Uh, 